everyone. Today we are going to distress this uh, barn door. Um, she wants it, I don't know, distressed, rustic looking. So Tristan and I, let me turn you around. These doors are what, 66? Yeah. These are huge, huge doors. There's gonna be two of them. So, yeah, 60 feet, nine feet. 66 inches wide. 66 inches wide. There you go. Did y'all hear that? And then we're going to stain everything and we're using preventable and then we're going to put white on it and then we're going to distress it. So I think it's going to look really, really pretty. Bless you. Now we have it stained. We have our little helper, little Miss Presley. Say hi, everyone. Hi. <laughs> Say hi. <laughs> okay, so um, we have it stained, and now we're going to put the paint mixed with water and put that on there and distress it. We're going to see what that is going to be. Say hi, everyone. Say hi, everyone. <laughs> okay, so let's get started. Okay, so I started, I got my white paint, and I just used white flat paint, put some water in it, and then put it on the door. Come back with a rag and wipe it. And after I do that, I'll put some white on. And then I'm going to sand some of these areas with the knots and stuff that's going to give it the uh, distressed antique look. So you see here, fingers in the way, you see that and then you see the stain and get another angle. this little car out of the way. <laughs> Get paint on it. She might not like that. At least with uh, distressing and antiquing, you don't have to uh, be perfect. Because that's the whole thing, of reason why we do this. But I have to admit, I do like the look after it's all completed. It's really pretty. But it's a lot of work. Okay, we're gonna keep doing this. Then we'll turn it over and do the other side. Okay. Okay, so now this is done. I put white on it, then I took a sander, and I will show you that um, in the next step. I just wanted to show you this uh, door completed on this one side. 
Okay, so I have my paint here with just, um, sorry about that, um, just flat paint in water, like I said before. And then I just start with the stain door and there's no rhyme or reason. I just put the mixture of the paint and the water on and then I'll just cover the whole door and I'll get it as white as I want it and then come back with the sander and distress it and I'll show you that. Okay, this is the final look. Now, tomorrow we hang it. The customer is gonna do a ceiling mount and it will be black hardware. So I will show you the video on that after they're hung. Okay, this is one door hung. Watch y'all see this. This is a ceiling mount. And then all we have to do is put the other side on and then put the handles on. That's what it's looking like. <laughs>